gonna see what I see. I'm excited uh, for the Blu-ray to come out simply because uh, seeing a movie set in the house while you're at home is a very different experience than in the yes. theater. Yeah, I think it's, it's, a, it's a good uh, movie yeah. to watch in that format for sure. Yeah, the, 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 the best experience would be to watch that movie at home alone, right? That would be, that would be interesting, something totally different from what you get when you go to a the theater. Is that something that you have to consider when you're, when you're making it, or are you just making it for the big screen and... I think, it, I think the mistake will be to make it for the big screen because I, I, I've seen that happening. Like, if you get too obsessed with the fact that, okay, this is going to be seen in a huge screen and blah, blah, particularly like the way the world works today where a lot of people love to see their movies at home. And it, I mean, a lot of people go to the theater still, but, but there's a lot of, particularly for this genre, that they like to see it at home with friends. So I think if it works, I try to design it in a way that it should work. It should be great to watch it on television at home. And, and never just expect that it's going to work in the theaters because it might work in the theater but not work at home. So we always design it for that format to imagine if I'm at home watching the thing, what happens? Because if that one worked, then the theater will work for sure, right? Because the theater, I think, makes everything, elevates all the experience of most movies, right? So, but I think this one has enough for you that if you watch it at home, it's, it's a great experience or probably even better. Yeah, and also, also the theater, it's a, the movie in the theater only represents what, like, 5% of the life of the movie, right? The rest, throughout the years, the movie's gonna live in this format, Blu-ray, DVD, or whatever, a digital format yeah. at home. So that's, actually, this is the, the real launching of the movie. Now the movie's gonna exist in the world in this format, you know, for hopefully forever. Yeah. So, yeah, it's very, very important. I like the idea of you're at home watching this and it gets really scary and, and then you look down the hallway, it's all dark at night, you go back to television, I think, they create that moment that, and then you turn it off and have to play some cartoons or something to kind of cleanse yourself from the experience. I, I like that. But I think we, our, our attitude as filmmakers is really to try to be as shocking as we can so we, we don't mind alienating an audience. We don't mind kicking some people out of the theater if they're not true fans, if they don't have what it takes to take the movie. And, and we like to see that happen. And we have seen that happen in Evil Dead. We have seen this happen on this movie. I mean, obviously we don't care because they have bought the ticket at that point, right? So we don't mind them leaving. But we, we do want to give the audience an experience they have never gotten before, right? And, and expose